Got red magenta. Okay, so what did I do? Oh wait, how do I even do this? But when I was little, I did have piojos, y'all. I could have made it. He want the scoop. She want the tea. She want the tea. I cannot speak. I gave Uno an ice, y'all. So he fucking that shit up back there. Hey y'all, welcome, welcome back to my channel. It's Melanie the pop star, as I call myself. I feel like I haven't vlogged in like two days, so I'm kind of like a little shy. You know, I gotta loosen up a little bit because then I'm just awkward as fuck. And we don't want that right now. We, we don't want to do with that. Shout out to my man. He got me a new little hitter, so I'm gonna be lit this whole time. You trying to get lit? You know what to do. Um, This flavor is raspberry lemonade. Lux. Ooh. Uno boy is here with me, so I'm not lonely today. <laughs> Oops, sorry. All right, y'all. As y'all can tell by the mother freaking title, I'm gonna be dyeing my hair today. Um, I'm gonna go hang out with my homegirl, and I was like, it's the 22nd already, y'all. Christmas is coming up. And I'm gonna go outside, hang out with my friend. Like, might as well touch up the roots. So I went to Sally's, let me show y'all what I got. I'm, I've been doing this for so long, y'all. I have been literally dyeing my hair since seventh grade. Oh no, what's wrong, buddy? Do you miss your daddy? He wants to go lay down on the bed. I know he wants to lay down on the bed. I'm gonna let him. Right here, on the blanket. Thank you, thank you. Mm. I got me a little cookita so we can stay hydrated throughout the video. Okay, little story time, y'all. I threw away the actual little um, bowl that I would use to dye my hair because I had dyed my hair and then I left the leftover hair dye in it and then I just let it sit right there for a couple days. And then like by the time I seen it, it just looked all nasty. So I was like, you know what, throw it. Today that I went to Sally's, they were like $5 for a bowl. And I was like, my story and I got like 20 Tupperwares in the kitchen. We finna just use that, okay? That's what I did. I got the like, the most scratched up one, you know, so that, you know, I love you, Swagger Eye, if you're watching this. Like. So I got three hair dyes. I always get three hair dyes and I literally had my hair like up to my ass. Three hair dyes would do it for me, but if you wanna be on the safer side, get four. Today I went with the safer side because I did recently cut my hair, so I would have I should have just gotten two, but I was like, I don't want to be dyeing my hair and then getting hella sad because I don't have enough, you know? What the hell? I put Netflix. Also, this right here, my friend left it in my truck. Um, she got it for like her swag guy. It's so cute. Okay, y'all. So I zoomed y'all up a little bit so we can be up close and personal. So if you're watching this because you want to dye your hair red. Best believe, girl, I'm not no professional. I don't even be doing it myself. My man be doing it for me, girl. But he's at work and I'm not, so I gotta do it. When I didn't live with my man, my mom would do it. So this is like gonna be like my third time doing it on myself. Am I nervous? A little bit, but it's never that serious, girl. If you mess up, girl, you can re-dye it again. No worries, all right? So let's get into it. I hella forgot my gloves, so I'm gonna go get some. I'll be back. Okay. So these are the ones we had in the kitchen. My swagger has a bunch of colorful ones, so I picked the green ones. Put your gloves on, what time is it? Ooh, girl, it's 6.53 and my homegirl was like, okay, I'm gonna call you at seven so we can, so I can see like if you're almost done. I have not even started, so I need to hurry up. Okay. Okay, guys, I got red, magenta, and red. For now, I'm gonna do the magenta and red. I'm gonna mix magenta and red. So let's just do that. A little life hack that my mom taught me actually. We just started doing this because we realized it was so difficult when you open it up here. Hold on, a little coquita break. Mm. 
so it's real difficult when you open it on top so don't do that girl don't do it get you some little tijeritas and cut it right here cut it like that oh yep like that and boom it opens all of it and then just you know like slowly squeeze it out I'll just use all three of them if I need to. This shit can get real messy real fast, y'all. So have a little trash can nearby. For those who want to know the exact price, I paid $47.80. You like the way I fuck because I get rough. You told me your new man don't make. Anyways, this is how it looks, y'all. It's real satisfying. Also, this brand also has like a bunch of... Did you fart, Uno? He be farting all the time, y'all. Um, I It was me farting and blaming it on him. No, I'm just kidding, but I thought he farted. So, it looks like two a little bit. So, I'm going to just say yellow and do all three. Low-key, their price got higher. Their quality got a little more like... So, they need to knock it off and go back to the when the... Little, they need to knock it off and go back to when the hair dyes were five dollars. They're like ten dollars now. Let me check. Eleven ninety nine with tax. Someone just mentioned me on their story. I want to see what they said. Uh. Ooh, my homegirl's calling me. Mm. Hey. Why did you got dye in your hair? I'm taking too long. Well, I just got out the shower barely right now, but I was going to ask for survive. Like, am I putting on pajamas or am I putting on an outfit? Uh, like, P PJs too. Like some Christmas PJs? I have my Christmas PJs, but do you have your juicy set? Pajamas. Those? Those are cute because I kind of have the ones that are kind of the same to that. Remember? Remember this one? Oh, yeah, those are cute. You should wear those. Yeah, just wear that then. I don't know what I might wear, but I'll figure okay, it out. It's a pajama party? <laughs> yeah, we gonna wear pajamas, bitch. Okay, okay. All right. I put the shit in my hair, though, so. So, I literally just estimate how much I put. I tell people it's like pancakes, because all of y'all be overthinking how much developer to put in your hair dye. Girl, if you need it, put it. Like, ooh. I don't even have a little. So, I'm gonna use this. Anyways, like I was saying, a lot of y'all be like, uh, be scared to put the developer. I don't know why. I just be putting that shit in there. I tell people it's like pancakes, you know? Le tienes que poner, I don't know, some people put milk or water in the pancakes. I do both. If I don't got no milk, I'm going to put some water. But most of the time I put milk. I don't know, some people actually like measure everything. Like, not me. Like, I'm Mexican. We just put that shit. We put the seasoning. We don't got to measure nothing. And tell the texture is nice and thick and I know like it looks good for my hair then I'll do it what you don't want to do is put too too much developer with a little bit of hair dye because then it's gonna get watery you don't go putting the whole bottle you know what I mean no, no, no. Like, oh, I always start with the roots because my roots is what is growing out so I gotta um, leave the hair dye on there longer so that it could die because it's black. This is already red, so nomás lo me lo pongo un ratito and then it'll get red right away. What I focus on is the roots, but I'm not really sure if you don't have red hair. Do you go on the roots first? No, I'm pretty sure you start from the bottom if you have virgin hair or don't have red hair because otherwise the roots um get super, super brighter than your actual hair. I'll leave a picture. A lot of y'all be coming out with that. I don't even know what y'all be doing, but I'm... I'm here to show y'all what I do, so I hope it helps a little bit. Developer has a lot to do with it too. If you want like brighter hair, like go up more, but I'm gonna just stick to 30. Um, I'll put a little more. But yeah, I think this is real good texture. I'm gonna um, part my hair. I part it in the middle. I'll show y'all that right now. Okay, y'all see that? Like obviously it's not pancake mixture, you know what I mean? But it's like that thick hair dye. It's like the texture of the hair dye but with the developer added y'all yeah. I literally don't want to dirty my vanity okay okay is it focused on me are you focused okay boom this is how short my hair is y'all 
I cut it and I still have anyone to go layer it. It's because I, I want to book with this one girl, but homegirl is booked all month till next year. So I'm going to wait for her because I'm loyal. That's what y'all need to know. That's what y'all need to do. Wait on the good because if you just like go with whoever, like, no. Also, my hair has been getting thin, you guys. It's not as thick as it used to be. But it's a hate and love relationship because I'm going to do my hair hella fast right now because it's not as thick as it usually is. Oh, it kind of feels thick. Never mind. <laughs> no, never mind. It is feeling a little thick right now. Okay, so what did I do? What did I do is... Oh, wait. How do I even do this? Don't overthink that shit. Just dye it. Come on now. You overthink it, you're never going to do it. So just do it. And if you fail, try again. And if you don't want to try again because you... Cause I don't know. Getting it hella on my forehead, but it's not because I want to get it on my forehead. It's because I want to get my baby hairs. The baby hairs matter because if you have dark ass baby hairs and bright ass hair, baby girl. That's the look too, but not for me. I don't want to do that. Ooh, this hair looks so good. Hold on, someone text me? Nope. Okay. And also since I don't have anybody here to um dye my roots, I literally go all the way down like I'm not gonna miss the little spot, all right? Y'all don't need nobody, okay? Y'all can do it. Y'all just really overthink it because back then when I lived with my mom, I would always tell myself like, man, when I don't live with my mom anymore, who's gonna dye my hair? Like, I need my mom, you know? Like, I would seriously always think that because I would always think it was it's hard to dye your hair because it just looks too, too much, you know? Too much for me, but the older I got, the simpler it got. And that goes to life too, y'all. Y'all may be going through it, but the older you get, you'll grow, you'll grow stronger and you'll know how to deal with things. Now I know how to deal with my hair, so. Now I part it and then I do that and then I just start dyeing what's on the bottom of what I just dyed. And I can't even see too good, y'all. I actually need two ring lights. I need another one right here for real, but. But for right now, I have one, so I gotta use that. You can go ahead and scrub too. Don't be scared. Get in there, all right? So if it's your first time dyeing your hair, girl, just know it burns, okay? Like, I don't know if y'all ever had piojos, but when I was little, I did have piojos, y'all. I could admit it. And the treatment that my mom would put on my hair would burn the hell out of my scalp because the little piojitos would be in my hair. So the treatment was to kill the piojos, so the piojos would be like, like it, it hurted so bad. Anyways, fast forward, um, that's how it feels. Like, I swear to God, that's how it feels. It burns, I don't know how to explain it. You're literally burning your scalp, basically. Beauty is pain, and we knew that. We have been knew that, so. Boom, I did another little part. It's already kind of red down there, but don't be scared, because you might miss a spot. My camera was literally on full, on full mother freaking. And now it's on one little line. What's that about? What? What's going on? Before I go. I did most of the roots from the front. Now I gotta do the back, but I really don't know how. But we gonna do yellow, we gonna lift it up, and we gonna do that, okay? I really just want my hair to look hella red. Like, at this point, I don't even care where the hair dye go. It just need to go in the hair. I really need to buy a, a longer camera charger so that I can charge my camera while vlogging. I know some people do that, but the charger the camera came with is hella freaking short. It's like that long, like girl, be for real. Split it in the middle, split that in the middle, and then do some more random roots back there. Cause I know I probably missed some spots. I've been working all day. Go ahead. I'm gonna move on to this side over here and do the exact same thing y'all the exact same thing so <sighs> okay i'm gonna just vlog till my freaking camera dies because i already know that whole gonna die on me so it is what it is um i'll charge it while i shower and then i'll come out with the results you know what i mean but i be leaving my hair for like 40 30 minutes it all depends if i'm like in a rush or something like if i'm in a rush i'll be like you know what fuck it like or if it itches too much like if i'm like Ugh, i can't handle this I'll just go wash it because I hate putting myself through unnecessary pain. Like, girl, if you can fix the issue, go fix it. Go shower, you know? So that's what I do. Patience is key, but sometimes I don't got no patience, so. Mm. I'm going to part that. Mm. 
Get in there, y'all. Get in there. If not, your roots are not gonna die. You little tip for those who um get stained easily, like on their face, you know, like you if you don't want the red to stay, put um Vaseline, right? Yeah, put Vaseline around your head. That will help. Yeah, then what I do, I literally just scrub it all in together. I'ma still keep playing around with the back because I know I probably missed some back there. I'm gonna turn around so y'all can see how it looks. Okay, now I'm just gonna blend everything out. Oh, me doing a makeup tutorial. Not for real, I'm gonna just scrub everything in there. Then I literally grab some on my hand and I literally, we not missing no spots today, y'all. I split it, I grab the hair dye, I start with the bottom. Y'all hear Uno snoring in the back though? Make sure to get those ends, y'all. All right, y'all, my camera is officially dying on me, so I'll see y'all when I am out the shower. Bye. Hey, guys, so it is a couple days later. This was the final look um, on my hair. As you guys can tell in the video, I didn't use any bleach. Supposedly, the um, hair dye has has the bleach already in it so i'm not sure but either way i feel like the hair dye really doesn't damage my hair ah, <laughs> thank y'all so much for watching i love y'all 